If a Hollywood director conceived and put on film what coach John Madden and the Oakland Raiders are accomplishing for real, the movie-going public would freak. But against the Jets at Shea Stadium, it truly looked as if the Raiders had run out of miracles. The Jets, with number 32 Emerson Boozer alive and kicking, ran successfully as Boozer gulped 115 yards. But the elements and good defense combined, and the Jets led by only 3-0 at halftime. In the third quarter, New York's defense provided the spark. W.K. Hicks, number 33, intercepted a pass and slid 19 yards to the Raiders' 16. From there, Woodall threw a perfect pass to Pete Lammons, number 87, and the Jets led 10 to nothing. The Raiders finally scored late in the third quarter when George Blanda hit Warren Wells. But the Jets seemed destined to win. Al Atkinson made the Jets' second interception. Jim Turner kicked a field goal. And the Jets had a seemingly comfortable lead, 13-7. But with eight seconds left, it happened again. Monica's desperation he found Warren Wells in the end zone and the Jets had been just another victim in a long line of Oakland miracle finishes. The Raiders 14, the Jets 13.